Welcome back to the channel guys. I hope you're having an absolutely fantastic Christmas. Uh, as you can see, I've been getting trapped. I've got some new glasses, new app, new top. Got to have it all on, haven't we? Um, but most importantly, I've been bought some golf gifts actually, which I wanted to share with you guys. Um, and this is something I've trapped and bought for myself. It's a battle ready putter. And if you're not aware, PXG have currently got an offer on till 31st of December. Uh, where these reduced to 199 and I built an absolute beauty and I actually had to pay for this by the way this is not a freebie but let me show you this you know I'm a bit of a golf perv um, so obviously PXG box what we got in here a little bit of a sticker I'm gonna come and have a little zoom in what's in box um, got a new camera person today and look if you've watched the channel for a while, you know the one and done's a putter that I've used before. And like anything, you know what I'm like, I always sort of flip and change stuff. I sold it and actually a little bit of me regretted it. But what I've done this time, I ordered it in the specs that I got fitted for, for the Seymo. So when I got fitted for Seymo, they fitted me for 36 inch in length and two degrees upright. But I've gone for the extra long grip. It was no upcharge. So we've got the extra long grip. Because I like to hold it, as you see, with a bit of a reverse grip. But it's going to give me that flexibility of kind of going where I want to on the grip. I've got a lot more room to work with now. I might even change to a split grip. I'm not sure. I've been... I've been I, don't, I need to take these off now, can't I? <laughs> I've been um, experimenting with different grips. But at the minute, I'm probably going to be about there. I do absolutely... I can't wait to get this out on the course and try it. So that is my new putter, which I've trekked myself for Christmas. And I've got a few free gifts. I've not even seen what's in here. Um, so I thought I'd share that with you. So some of the manufacturers have sent a few bits and pieces over the last few weeks. And what I've done is, because I've been that busy with filming, guys, obviously if you've been watching the channel, we've been doing a lot on custom fitting. And obviously we've done a few videos with Sam and we've got some beauties coming up, which I'll share with you. If you're wondering what's going to be happening in January, I've got a bit of cold as well. I don't know if you can hear that, but... Um, some incredible, in fact, I'm going to, just before we open these, tell you what's coming up, because you'll be keen to know. Um, we've got a three-week trip planned, where I can't tell you where we're going, but we're going to vlog a lot of the trip. It's going to be a bit of golf and travel. I'm travelling solo, but I'm meeting a couple of people on the journey, and I'm going to somewhere in the world that no other YouTuber has ever been to play golf, and I can't wait to share that one with you. I think it'll be very eye-opening. I mean... I'm a little bit guilty of thinking that they didn't even play golf in that country. Like, I didn't even think golf were a sport, so it's going to be incredible to share that one. Um, and then in the near future, I've done a couple more videos with Sam. I've had a hybrid fitting, because obviously I've had the driver fitted. We've delved into a little bit of specs and irons, but I felt like I were in a driver a lot, and then I got nothing between irons and driver, because my hybrid just felt weird. So we've done a little bit of a fitting on that. That's going to be a cracking video. I can't wait to share that one with you. Um, and I guess we've just got these gifts open, haven't we? I don't know where to start. Start here. I have no idea what's in here. So let's see. <laughs> Get in the comments, guys. What golf stuff have you been bought for Christmas? Um, and what's your favourite gift? This is something I've never seen before. A TS Golf magnetic tower i'd love anyone to comment as well if they've got any of these gifts or they've, they've already got the items you know what's your personal opinion on them because i'm not going to be able to give you any reviews on this stuff because i've only just got it so looks like we've got a little bit of a magnetic clamp i guess that could be good if you're going to flip between like maybe maybe for for a buggy you could stick that on the side of a buggy couldn't you or on the side of your golf bag, and you've got you can carry that around. I know a lot of people like to sort of tuck them in the pocket, but you wouldn't need to then. You could just move that in. I'll tell you what, I'll put up on screen all the companies that have sent me presents just in case any of this stuff might be of interest to you. TS Golf Magnetic Towel. Like that. I'll definitely be using that. It's black as well, I can keep it clean. What's this? A golf swing system shirt. I think I might have seen this on Instagram, actually. Golf swing shirt. I have I've seen these on Instagram. This looks like a really good trend, Nate, for anybody 
who wants to work on sort of connection, you know, between arms and body. It's like a bit of a, a vest you put on. I'd love to hear if anyone's tried this before. I think I'd look good in that. <laughs> so it looks like you put your arms through there. And I guess it gets that, helps you get the perfect sort of connection between arms and body. I'll tell you what as well, if there's any of these items you'd like me to test and do a video on on the channel, um, I'll, you know, obviously, you can uh, guide me on what you want to see me do first. If you want me to try any of these and test them. What's it say, actually? Let's see. Maybe I'm not right. Yeah, connection. Most great ball strikes and pros know that connection is very important. And in a good golf swing, as well as not flipping your hands at impact, the, the player has to have a good connection to strike the ball efficiently. Mm. <laughs> oh, they're definitely golf balls. And I need some golf balls. Strixen 8. I've got the perfect video for these. I've been waiting for some new golf balls to come. This must be the 2024 Strixen AD treble free ball which I know a lot of people use. Do you know what I'm gonna do with these? I've got some um, pond balls, some pond AD treble freeze, and one subscriber asked, to, asked me, he said, guys, I'd love you to do a video and compare a brand new ball versus a pond ball in reasonable condition, you know, one that you might go out and buy, a, a reused ball, to see if there's any difference in performance between new and used balls, so that's gonna be a good video. Can't wait to do that one. Got three left. This is small. Hope it's nothing that shouldn't be. <laughs> Someone stitched me up. <laughs> oh, it's vibrating. I'm only joking. It's um, a key ring. Oh, I've seen these again. This is another company I've seen on uh, Instagram. Funky little key ring. Looks like a golf ferrule. I'll definitely be using that one. I'll tag them actually, they do some really cool different coloured feral key rings. Um, and I think the company, I, I think they were an American company actually. I'll tag them. Not sure about this, it's soft. Ah, I've been saying I need some new golf gloves. I think people must listen to these stories that I put out. <laughs> Has anyone wore these before? I've seen a lot of these on Instagram. GX golf gloves. Um, leather Cabretta glove. I think they retail like round about £10. So price are a kind of a Weathersoft glove. A, a Footjoy Weathersoft. You know what I might do with these? That looks actually a really nice leather glove. I might do a blind test with some golfers. And get them blindfolded. Putting this glove on. Verse like something else in its price range to see if they're as good as what, you know, obviously GX are claiming to, that they are. I have I have actually tried one of these before and I thought it were all right, but um, get in the comments if you're wearing these guys, what's your thoughts on the GX golf player's glove? I know they're good value. I'm sure I saw an offer at like three for 30 pound posted, so I think they're reasonably priced. Right, the final present before our farewell Christmas message. Ooh, this is interesting. Hack motion. This is um, this is one I've really been wanting to try. Actually, I don't know if you've seen these before. So this is a gadget you put on your wrist. This could be a good video. I'm not quite sure how it works actually. But what it does, it measures the your release patterns and your, and your path of your arms. And it can actually suggest to you. I mean, you know, for you guys who probably haven't got access to golf coaches, and I know, like, from speaking to some of you guys before, especially in America and Canada, it can, be, it can be 200 pounds for a golf lesson. It can be, like, 200 miles to travel to a pro. It's almost like having your personal coach, basically, where it'll recommend, based on your swing, um, you know, obviously things that you can do to improve your swing, like drills and stuff like that, and bits and pieces. So I can't wait to test what that one. That'll be a really good video. I'm surprised they've sent me that there. I'm not, I won't say them, but I think they're about 200 pound for, or 250 pound. 
something like that. So that's a really nice gift from Hack Motion and uh, definitely looking forward to trying that. My Christmas message for me this year, Christmas is going to be a good Christmas. It's not going to be a lonely Christmas. I had a couple of lonely Christmas, I'm not going to lie, where I've been. Can't wait to see back at Christmas. Um, can't wait to see New Year, you know, Christmas, New Year. I just like, it's not for a single person. And I know a lot of people are probably going to be struggling over Christmas if you've lost a partner or, you know, so my thoughts are with you this Christmas and just to send a reminder out that, you know, you're only a week away from New Year and once we get into New Year, if you're having a tough time at the minute, things will get back to normality and you'll be fine. So hold yourself together for a couple more weeks if you're struggling around Christmas. And um, apart from that, I think, obviously, enjoy yourself. Enjoy yourself as much as you can. Share, you know, some good times with your families. Um, and make sure you tune in for January, because January is going to be a big, big month for me. Probably the best month I've ever had in making content, basically. Um, so I'm looking forward to I'm looking forward to 2024. And I think, finally, I just want to thank you for your support this year. And I couldn't be doing all this without you, so... Yeah, that's it. Merry Christmas, and we'll be seeing you at New Year. Bye.